Yeah, Sean. No, Sean. Don't talk because it's a bit hard pace. <laughs> Make sure your weights are not everywhere so you can stay still. And... <laughs> All right, so I'm out at Manzanita this morning. I don't particularly like this park. I'm going to tell you guys why. So, if you guys can see, you can clearly see there's a problem here. I mean, why is this fence so close to this manual pad slash ledge? Like, you don't think they could have shifted the fence out a tiny bit just so there was more space so it doesn't bottleneck right here? It doesn't make any sense whatsoever. People come bounding down here and then um, <clears throat> you can't see anything past this fence. So you could be like screaming past a manual pad and someone could be coming in the opposite direction. Boom, collision. Like, and then in the afternoon, the sun hits the, the fence and then it casts this weird shadow on the ground that screws up your depth perception. But uh, yeah, this is Manzanita. Fun little bowl section here. Flat bar, ledge people sit on. And uh, yeah, there's a pool here also. Not like a traditional kidney shaped pool, but there's an extra corner here. You guys can see. You wanna do a back 50 then a front lip? Yeah. I think you should just like actually like skate skate this thing. Like get comfortable zipping around. You do a lot of where like you'll try the trick that you're learning, like a street spot, and then get out of it. Mm. Like just stay in the pool. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, don't plan what to do. Just let, let the transition decide your line. Wherever you end up, you end up. You, I feel like you have enough tricks that you can do something in different spots. Ooh. Your main goal is you want to do a front lip on something. So. Yeah, I'm trying to front lip that, that one there. But uh, trying to front lip that, ollie this, elbow, hip, whatever. That one's a bit mellower, isn't it? It's less of an angle? Yeah, I think so. Which means it'd probably be harder to go with hot, higher. I think this is the easiest hip to get air on. Okay. Yeah. Because you can go like this angle far. Yeah. You know, it's like when you do it on a straight wall, you have to ollie away from transition. This, you can ollie over the top corner and still okay. not hit the coping. Yeah, I want to do back 50. It doesn't have to be in line. Back 50, front lip, back lip, all of this, and then a Smith somewhere. Back lip? Yeah, yeah, I said back lip. Oh, okay. Back tail. Ooh. How do you do a back tail? You just... Yep, you just did but it. For a moment there, are your back trucks up on the coping? You come close to it. Sometimes, yes. Sometimes you accidentally... Because you can just like... I ollie into mine, but most people, they just kind of whip into it really hard. And that works more consistently. What about a front tail? Once again, I ollie into it, but you can just whip into it. But your trucks are kind of like... Kind of. Teetering. It's right there. Your wheels are just right there. Sometimes you'll accidentally scratch a little grind. Is it like a ledge, though, to get... No. Someone told me it's, like, different than skating It is. Ledge. It is. It's different. But you lean on it the same once you're in it. Okay. Kind of. No, that's not true either. You lean in transition the whole time. I feel like it looks really stiff. You look fine. There you go. Right. There you go. Oh. No comply. Less uh, aggressive angle for the 50. Yeah, then you're just in it. Because if you're already like uh trigonometry basically. trigonometry is trigonometry so you carve it and then you're already there so i'm trying to like get there then get on my weight goes all the way on the deck yeah doesn't make any sense and you got all that weight to throw around yep all this 70 kilos <laughs> stop making numbers up <laughs> oh ohio oh, fuck. that's sick <laughs> Today. And what? And are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Yeah. Your worst fear is nowhere near as bad as my worst fear. What? I don't know, is there poop in your pants? No. Okay. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs>
<laughs> yeah, Sean. No, Sean. I'm trying to get one like here. Mate, your 50 50s are all of a sudden there. Yeah. You're trying to get up there? I would love to get I I want to get there. Just get that berth just right. Yeah, you need a nice medium sized berth here. Yeah. Do you reckon it's possible? Yeah, I, I think it's possible. <clears throat> It looks like your 50-50s are just working now. Yeah, because you told me the secret. <coughs> Wider berth. Wider berth at the bottom. Curve it. Carve it, I mean. Carve yeah. up to it. Oh, yeah. 50-50s all day. I hope this ice cream music gets them demonetized. Oh, I'm going the wrong way. No, you're not. Just do tricks. Wow. Yeah, more tricks. Yeah. Oh, the Ollie Uper? <laughs> Stop shooting. I don't even have guns in Australia. Let me see if I can go back to that. Yeah, you got it. Oh, you had it. That a boy. That was good. Is that it? Yeah. What do you mean that was it? It was all like. Oh, you got it. Oh, you got it. Getting too straight in the bowl. Getting too straight in the bowl, dude. What else can I do here? You should learn uh, some convenient turnaround tricks like blunt to axle stall and stuff like that. Uh, pow, pow. Uh, yeah, sure. That's a bit. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah. See, once you're in the blunt, you just give it a little baby. Like it's so easy to get from here to there. Like that's all it is—is is the most subtle movement. Where's your weight when you blunt it? So you're still back away from the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You don't want to get too on top of the deck. I mean, you can if you want to solve there forever, but you don't want to solve there forever. Yeah. I'll start yelling at you. Alright, I'm gonna turn around and try. It. Yeah. Most 50 50 dude. Oh, wait, no, he fucked up. Most trap in, dude. Is that it? Yeah, that was it. Look at that aggressive kick turn into that. Oh, look at that. your video you're all make sure your weights are not everywhere so you can <laughs> stay still and <laughs> <laughs> he wants to boost the hip i say he boosts the hip you should boost the hip i can't boost that hip for shit oh yeah you got good confidence with your ollie oh fuck falls dropping in Oh, yeah, you're way up there. So this is something that I struggle a lot with, having the confidence to, like, commit to my ollies, like, on transition when I, like, really snap above coping. And Sean doesn't know how scary it is, evidently, because he's just roasting them. Yeah, I felt like I hit my fucking... I stopped the... Up. Yeah, you, you, you cut yourself off. Yeah. It's hard to really let yourself go up until you're done. What do you mean? <laughs> like a lot of times, instead of sucking your legs up to float higher, I like hold my legs down with my upper body so I don't go any higher because I get scared. Yeah, I feel like I like stop myself. Yeah. Just gotta throw yourself up there like you were earlier. Just do one, you got it right here. That was a good one. That's what I'm saying, the hip tosses you that way, so you can go more this way instead of trying to ollie that way. Let's have a gander. Big ollie guy, dude. Yeah. Or the pop from down under. <laughs> Kangaroo pop. Next, back tail. What? What? Back tail. 
How do you do a back tail? What do you mean? You just turn into like a front tail. How do you do a front tail? I don't, I don't know how to front tail transition. Okay, well, let's do back tail then. Which is harder to see? Uh, I would say that back tail is easier and more scary, and front tail is harder and less scary. Uh, okay. Is it kind of like a back flip when you just... Yeah, you just kind of whip into it. Don't be afraid to over-rotate. Sometimes that's the easier way to slide. More rainbow. More what? More rainbow. Oh, shit. I'm not so aggressive. Yeah, what I mean by rainbow is carve more this way when I tell them that. Yeah, wide of berth. Wide of berth. Wide berth. All right, guys. You almost back tail slightly below the coping. That's better. All day it's been this. Yeah, but that, that, that's a fine fall. It doesn't hurt. Just good times for everybody. I'm still trying to break it down. You just make that squeak. That's all you need to worry about. It's a power slide. Oh. Yeah, that's it. That was it. It doesn't seem like a trick. I hate you. It doesn't like seem like a uh, uh, kind of thing. It's not. It's just like every other trick. It's delicate, baby. Shit. Ballet into that back tail. It's just kind of like a... It looks aggressive, but yeah. it's not. How does that work, though? I don't know. So all, all, the, all these years I've been watching people skate in videos and I see them back tail quarter pipes and it's just a little... Yeah, every, every single skater on Anta here is a delicate fairy. They're just, <laughs> they're just floating around the park with their six packs of Paps Blue Ribbon. But really, it's fairy dust in there. See you, dude. All right, Take care. Oh, man. I'm going to be hyped if I get this. You could just do it right now. Just get it right here. Get out there and be somebody. That was closer. You're still going a little, really? a little more rainbow. Rainbows and fern, <laughs> rainbows and fairy dust. It's like we're, we're watching Fern Gully. Boys in slime. Is that Disney? Yeah. Literally should have just dropped in. You I'm could have done that one. Figuring my weight out. Just drop in. The weight's figured out. You're sliding, baby. What is immediately you get in, you get out. No, you just slide and then drop in. Yep, nope. Had it. Ah! Can't come from Australia and start complaining about being hot here. It's a different type of heat. Because I've been yeah, here our long heat, enough. Our, our yeah. heat is free. And then when, <laughs> when it gets cold here, I'm like, ooh, it's getting chilly. And it's not even that cold. I'm just so climatized here. Anyway. You said climatized? Like yeah. traumatized, but climatized? Climatized. Climatized. <laughs> you son of a bitch. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready, Lenny, you piece of shit. Is it going to be it? Is hey, it? Don't talk because it's a bit hard pace. <laughs> The confidence of this man. Oh. Jinx myself. He said, he said don't talk, it's gonna be the hard pass. If you're going too on top, you gotta be more in transition. Do the back tail lower. Stop back tail. What do you mean? The deck, back tail the coping. Oh, okay. That was better. Why did you not land that one? I stood up. You just jumped off. That was perfect. My shoulders were like, like You, If you would have dropped in, you would have been fine. Nah, because I would have gone. No, you would have gone, wee, I did it. <laughs> right here, to stay in ramp. <laughs> and then can't get out of the, the bowl. Do another one. Is that it? Do another one. Right here. Yeah, you got it now. Not like that, though. Yeah, watch out for the cough. Don't back tail my cough. Yeah, you just <laughs> you're just kind of zipping into it. Yeah. It's not a back tail on a ledge at all. No, nothing like that. Because when you're back tailing a ledge, you can kind of just let go, and then your body just comes out. Yeah. 
This is like, you're just like power sliding it. You do a two wheel power slide with your tail scraping the coping. Yeah. That's really what it is. Well, then why is it called a back tail? Cause it is a back tail. <laughs> All right. I reckon front tail will be easier. Okay, do front tail. How to do it. Same thing, just it's the other way. You got it. I mean, you said back tail. Back tail's way scarier. How do I? Just whip that tail and just power slide. Same thing. Yeah, kind of like that. A little more. Skirt. That's like a 5 to tail. You got to do a little baby ollie. That'll probably help you. I ollie mine, yeah. It's like a little baby whip. Not necessarily like a, where you snap your tail to Ollie, but you know. Yeah, that one you went straight into. Yeah. Yeah, that was it. That slid. Do another one if you want. Yeah. Yeah, you got this. Like it. 150. Back tail, front tail. All over the hip? All over the hip. Four little, four little tricks. Okay, so what you're doing in here is what I wanted you to be doing in there for the 50-50s. You're going real wide and whipping. Okay. Whereas to slash the coping when you're first learning, you want it to be more of like a, not a straight line, but more of a triangle than a U. Okay. So you're going like this. Yeah. What I want you to do is take the exact same amount of speed. It's like very gentle. Is it really though? You're not going like this, Mike. I don't want you to be like here. You're just going to get that wheel above and come back in like it's real. What about if you hang up? That's where danger is. Just, let, just keep kick running until you're so close to the coping that you accidentally hit it. That's all you gotta do. So I would start front side slash this thing. It seems like it'd be harder. Nope. Slash, not grind, slash. It's a little chip. There's like an extra corner in this bowl. I don't care what corner you get to, slash somewhere over here. <laughs> Yep, that was it. That's all it is. That was a baby slash. That's all you want. You don't need to get on top of it. Do the exact same thing on the coping, and then you get to hear that cool sound, and then people will high five you and shit. How tall this thing is. I've never seen anyone take a literal run up to the deep end of a bowl. <laughs> like, get out of there. It's one of those things that the first time that you actually try to do the front side slash, you're just gonna do it. It's just a matter of making yourself do that first initial try. Yeah. It's gonna be so satisfying though, because like when you scratch metal coping, like if you just scratch it like that, it's almost like the most anticlimactic feeling ever. You feel a little bump and you hear a little eh, and you're like, ugh. But when you do it on pool coping, it's the exact same thing, except for you're like, yeah. It's just, it's just yeah. the aesthetic and sound of it. I've hit pool coping before, but it was like- Not in a- deep end of a pool. Yeah, it was in like the shallow end. <laughs> okay, get in there and scratch them, buddy. Thing, dude. Just go, just like yeah, you went more of like a straight line for this, do the same thing over there. Don't carve oh, so wide. There is coming up, slashing, and then over rotating. Yeah, that's a thousand percent not happening. That's like the biggest fear. If that happens, I'll give you a hundred bucks. <laughs> How do I get up there? What do you mean? Just go. You just go up there and then you're there. That was pretty much it. I touched it. You were literally like a centimeter away. Just go more straight at it. You! Is that it? I don't know. Do it again.
Like, how easy was that? That's literally every trick you've ever learned that I suggested. You learn it like first try, and you're like, it wasn't that bad. You could be the greatest skater in the world if you just try every you know trick. What, uh, what helps me with like transition that's like like that? Thinking that I'm close to the ground, but on a wall. Does that make sense? Nope. Like, woo, like I think that I'm like safe because I'm closer to the walls. Like, it's oh, like the, the transition is flat ground too. Yeah. You're saying the transition is just flat ground that continues up with yeah. you. Because when you skate up, your weight just goes up. You're weightless for a second. It just feels like you're. Yeah, usually when you fall in transition, if your body weight is correct, you fall into the transition, not away from the transition. Yeah. Ironically, fear usually dictates people body weight away from the transition, which is the worst place to go. Yeah, that's, that's my problem. Well, you just did it super easy. Do it again. Shit. 27 to be true. 27. Yeah, all day. Yeah, he thinks the nude bowl is less scary because it's steeper and he yeah. can't get as close to the coping. Or is this one like you drop in, you're guaranteed yeah, to be nude, at the coping. Nude ball is like, it's so steep that you can't even get high enough to get that hurt if you're not super comfortable in transition. Plus yeah. the ground's really yeah, rough. The nude ball, you fall to flat, which I feel like is more comforting for me. The, pain, the painted ball, like the paint on that ball just makes it sketchy as fuck. Yeah. Uh, yeah. It feels like this. Yeah, that place seems like an, I still haven't skated it, but you it looks like a nightmare. Yeah, I'm down. On your way back, bring me his son. On, 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 on your way back, bring me his son. 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 On, 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 on your way back, bring me his son. On your way back.